So today we're basically building a build in a contrasting style to what we built yesterday. Yesterday was a bridge in an elven style and today we're going to build a little cafe that's going to overlook the dock area and it is going to be built in a dwarven style. So when I think of like the difference between dwarven and elvish styles, one of the things that um, stands out to me is the color palette. Um, I personally tend to think of like a dwarven build style as darker colors, you know, those reds and blacks and um, yellow, which obviously we're going to be utilizing today. Um, I went with a deep state... I went with Deep Slate as opposed to like Blackstone just because I think it will um, reduce the harshness of of the color palette, um, though I might use Blackstone and Texturing, we'll see. Um, I'm also probably going to use Smithing Tables in the floor. That's something that I've seen used in various places, and it's really cool, and I'm excited to try it for myself. Let's get building. so far which is to be fair the point there's some fun details in the architecture from the the arched roof that's I don't know it's kind of a barn shaped roof but not exactly but then we added um, dormers I guess they're called I've always heard them referred to as gables but recently I think I heard they are actually called dormers 
let me know in the comments. <laughs> But we've got those adding a little bit more detail to this roof and keeping it from being a giant plain thing. Um, we've got arches in the walls as well with the deep slate in front and then the black stone behind. I think that worked out really well. Inside we've got lots of cozy details. I like this interior for the most part. I've been struggling with my interiors lately, but this one, this one's a good one. We've got the little kitchen coffee bar thing with the cash register. Um, a, a cool handle there. Let's not step on the turtle eggs. Um, and then just, you know, bar stools. I love that I love that these tables here have this great view out towards the docks and the park. I'm not sure what to put in this corner. Inspiration struck right as I was talking about how I didn't know what to put here. I think that's cute. Got a little like, you know, couch area with a painting and a plant and yeah, that works. That works for me. I love this fireplace. I love how this turned out. A um, little bit of inspiration from Pinterest and tweaked it to fit the space. And then outside, we've just got a couple of details, you know, shipping crates, stuff like that, a little garden bed, and um, some ingredients, I suppose. Kind of looks like coffee beans, right? Growing out here behind the kitchen. So yeah, I think this turned out pretty decent overall. I love the, the lantern sconces here. And just generally, the overall look of this build is pretty cool. I like it. Once again, we learn some things, we build some things, and then we call it a day. I think the main thing for me with this one was using those dormers on the roof. I had fun with this one, and I am excited to... to see how tomorrow's project turns out. I'm actually very excited for tomorrow's project. It's gonna be, it's gonna be cool. So tune back in for that tomorrow and I'll see you there. Bye. <laughs>